the son of Che Guevara. Ernesto Guevara Jr. has uh, opened up a new tour group agency in Cuba called La Padrosa. And if you would like, as a lover of Che Guevara and a dumb ass commie, you can pay $6,000, travel down to Cuba, hang out with the son of Che Guevara as he takes you on a motorcycle tour of the island of Cuba. You know, Che Guevara's famous motorcycle trip of 1952 across South America, and they made a movie about it, and it's so wonderful, and he's so neat, and they're young, and they're so full of life and so effervescent. Who doesn't want to be like him? I Googled this this morning, and the first thing that came up was, like, from Progressive.org, top ten movies about Che Guevara, and they all glorify him. He's a mass murderer. In fact, he would execute his son for being a capitalist, and there are at least 10 movies glorifying his existence, according to Progressive.org, and they list them for you. Now, how many movies are there glorifying the life of Ronald Reagan? Dun, 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 dun. Bum, 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 bum. None. And there it is, and I was, I was uh, reading this thing. You know, the American media isn't picking up on it much that I've seen, but the British media is all over it. And uh, fun stuff in the uh, comments, like, uh, you can always spot a loser. They're wearing Che T-shirts. It's an indication they went to an American university. <laughs> yes, it is, sadly.